Hi y'all, this is Star with Star's Empress Wisdom, and today, Sagittarius, I'm here to give you a reading, a love reading for this weekend. It's the first week of August 2019, and, oh, and I'm Star. Um, just, if you're new to my channel, I use regular playing cards. I find different playing cards all over the place, I have all types of decks. I let them name themselves to help me with uh, my divine insight and wisdom. Uh, so I just find different cards and name them. But anyways, I do also use like oracle cards sometimes, which I'm going to use it today. So um, let me, I'm going to start off with an oracle message for Sagittarius in love. If this resonates with you, awesome. If it doesn't, this message may not be for you at this time. Um, or, you know, just, there may be something in it for you, so stick around, you'll see. If you do resonate, like, subscribe, comment, um, if it doesn't, you don't need to tell me, that's alright. Just go, you know, there's lots of other readers on here. So, Sages, Sages in love, what's some advice for this weekend for Sag in love? Alright, Sun. You got the sun card. You may be dealing with a Leo. Um, enjoy success and happiness. It's time for you to enjoy, su enjoy success and happiness. You may be going into a time um, where, you know... Alright, Sagittarius. So, you may be going into a time... Hold on one second. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Again, Sagittarius. Okay, so you may be dealing with a Leo um, right now. Oh. Let's see. It says, help me stay grounded in the present and enjoy my life more, Sagittarius. It may be that you need to enjoy this summer as, you know, enjoy this summer. Things, as things become more illuminated in your life, um, you know, enjoy it. Enjoy your successes. Enjoy, you know, you have to be happy inside in order for happiness to surround you. So it may be that you need to stay grounded right now. Um, go outside, be with nature, and enjoy the present moment. Enjoy life a little, a lot more because um, life is precious, Sagittarius. Life is precious. All right, let's see. I'm going to go into with your person, uh, soulmate, twin flame, or this could be soul tribe. It could be a friend or a family member. But it's someone that you love that you're thinking about at this time. What is this person thinking about you? Sagittarius. Okay, so right now, Sagittarius, this person may feel like you are a heartbreaker. Or you can have Gemini in your chart. But this person may feel like you're um, you're being a heartbreaker. And they're trying to pray, or they're praying about the situation between you and them. Um... You may be dealing with a fire sign, another fire sign, a Leo, Aries, or a Sagittarius. And look, you may definitely be dealing with the Leo, because this is Leo. And then we have this fire sign right here. So your person may be seeing you um, as ambitious, determined, and successful, but a heartbreaker. Like, they may feel like you have broken their heart, you know, because of competition. Maybe others. It may not. It doesn't have to be a love situation. Like it doesn't have to be a third party. But it definitely could be that maybe you, uh, your person, feels like you are just focused elsewhere right now, and they feel like, uh, you know, you're so, you know, basically you're doing your own thing right now, and it's causing anxiety for this person, and it's causing illusions. So they may be completely just making, you know, having fantasies about you and other people and it's causing fighting but they do want to leave the past behind and make a choice with you but the problem is that they've been waiting around discontent probably not you know speaking up and letting you know how they feel so um let's see how this person feels about you in their heart space how they're feeling emotionally about you, Sagittarius. Okay. Right now they are guarded. Their feelings are hurt because maybe you're getting positive results in your life. And you're moving forward positively. And they want a reunion with you. 
again, fire sign, again, Leo, Aries, Sag. They want, uh, they see you moving forward, ambitious, successful, determined, um, and it may be scaring them a lot. You know, they may feel like you are focused on yourself and focused on your own success and your own things. And, oh, look what just popped up. They might feel like you would play a player because of this, but you might just be focused on being successful or focused on your own spiritual growth. Um, let's see. Yeah, they feel like you may have a new love or they feel a positive love between the two of you and they want to make a choice. They want to make a choice about a, a possible air sign, Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. Um, that may be, yeah, someone they need to communicate with. It could be an ex. It could be another family member or something. Um, some type of choice or decision that they have to make. Yeah, it could be that you guys are thinking about getting married, but there could be an ex in the way, or there could be just someone, you know, someone else in the picture that, uh, a possible air sign that's just, um, causing conflict within you guys' relationship. Um, yeah, and so right now your person is just waiting for the outcome between the two of you. And it looks like, oh, it looks like it might have to do with some type of money. Somebody, uh, yeah, maybe somebody is trying to protect some money or some situation like that. Um, and they're just all in their head about it. They're, instead of them talking to you, Sagittarius, it looks like they're just all in their head about the situation. But they ultimately want a reunion. So, let's see... Let's see, Sagittarius. What actions is this person going to take towards you in the near future here? What actions is this person going to take towards you in the near future? And, you know, again, it looks like maybe you are enjoying your life more and you're in a positive state and you're not uh, trying to be in the BS anymore. I think you were trying to avoid, the, um, avoid it last weekend as well, but it looks like you're trying to enjoy your life more. But it could be some family drama or something like that. And, you know, that somebody else is trying to drag you into. Or, uh, you know, some love drama. They're trying to think positive about their situation. About the situation between you and them. But they are mentally confused. About maybe you want to take a trip. Maybe you want to go somewhere. Uh, what the air sign again Libra Gemini or Aquarius so a Sagittarius your person may be uh, concerned about you taking a trip with someone and it's causing them to be extremely envious or this person your person could be an air sign and that could be causing them to be extremely envious that you want to take a trip. And you may want to take a trip by yourself to do something, you know, for success or for pleasure, for fun, to enjoy your life more. This person feels like you guys have a solid relationship and a stable foundation. So they might just be like, why, why are you going, why you want to go out and, you know, travel by yourself? We got... We got a stable situation here. We got a nice home together. We got everything here. What you need to go out there for? And you're just like, look, I'm a Sagittarius. I'll, I'm supposed to travel. I'm supposed to grow spiritually. And this situation is becoming too much. It's too much com or too much, you know, fighting. Probably too many uh, arguments, disagreements. You know, could be about a water sign, Pisces, Scorpio, or Cancer. So, you know, could be that's who you're dealing with. Jeez Louise, it's just popping up everywhere. It looks like your prayers are being answered right now, Sagittarius, but this person may not be able to handle it. And this person may be, you know, feel like you're a smartass or, you're, or they're being a smartass and they're, you know, because of confusion right now. Maybe you guys need to talk, you know, but if it's about between you and your happiness, you got to do what makes you happy, Sag, you know. If you're happy, you know, if going to travel and doing, you know, doing your own thing is going to make you happy and fulfilled in your life, then that's what you need to focus on and do because that's your advice overall. You need to enjoy life more and enjoying life doesn't, you know, 
it doesn't include drama and fighting and all that. It includes, you know, sometimes it takes going on journeys, traveling, things like that. So, any more actions this person is going to take towards Sag this weekend? They're dropping all the baggage. Okay. Okay. Yeah. So, it looks like they want to drop all the baggage between, you know, you and them right now. Maybe someone's been being frivolous with money. And they want to move forward. Maybe they've been being frivolous with money and they want to move forward. And maybe you want to go on a trip, but they know that they spent the money or something like that. So, you know, but again, this does not have to, this is not everybody. These are specific, specific situations. It could be that your person knows they spent a lot, you know, spent more money and didn't tell you. And you want to go on a trip by yourself. You want to go on a trip and they're saying they don't want to go. So you're like, hey, fine, I'll go by myself then. And they're like, well, why you want to go by yourself? Why you want to go on a trip by yourself? And there, that just started this whole. It could, you know, it could be a whole story about you cheating on them or something like that in their head. When the real problem is, is that they could have been being frivolous with the money and hiding it, but now they want to, you know. But they are making it seem like it's something else. What it is is your person may be unhappy with themselves right now and is trying to use tricks and manipulations to keep you, um, to keep you you know just staying with them stay make from making a decision you know they want you to just rest sit there they want you to sit okay they don't want you to make no moves sad and i know you like but i want to move okay yeah they may be uh vindictive or emotionally unstable at this time you guys are spiritually bound lovers but so regardless yeah they might want to text they might be texting or calling you soon about the turmoil in your relationship but the thing is, is, you know, this person shouldn't be afraid for you to go out and venture on your own. You guys, you know, if you guys love each other, which, it, you know, there's, you guys are spiritually bound lovers. So with that being said, that love is still there regardless. So this person shouldn't be insecure about you wanting to go off and do your own thing. Um, this person, it could be like a parent child situation where your parent doesn't want you want to let you go yet, but it's time for you to go. It's, they're completely burdened by it, you know, but you gotta go, you gotta be happy, you gotta have your son card, you know, you gotta have your success and happiness, let's get some advice from spirit, Sagittarius and love, even if it's a partner, you know, they, they gotta either go with you or you gotta fly solo, but if, if your spirit is telling you to travel and you know, do new things, follow new venture, be successful, do your own, you know, be independent, do that. Because we are all on this journey individually. And your heart, it looks like your heart is split between two right now. Maybe you want to make a decision to go. Look, possible move. That's my, I know it's ripped up. Oh, don't talk about my ghetto cards. But, so, you might be conflicted about a possible move you want to make soon. Again, boom. And it looks like this person may be rushing in fast. You know, this person may be rushing in fast to tell you like, hey, no, 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 don't go, don't, don't make a move. Again, this could be an air sign, Leo, Gemini, or Aquarius. Either, or you could be making a move towards a Leo, Gemini, or Aquarius and your person doesn't want you to do that or something like that. Maybe they're afraid for some reason. Um, but either or Sagittarius, follow your heart. Enjoy your life more. Whatever you need to do to do that, do so. Um, uh, enjoy the rest of your summer. Uh, this Good luck with everything, Sag. See you later.